This multiplication intervention is designed to allow your students to work through 40 weeks of intervention on the same skill. Now, some students might not need a full 40 weeks, but if you need it, because we all know in special education, there will be students who need it, you'll have enough for an entire year. And so inside, every day really looks very similar. And so each day we start by solving eight multiplication problems. I also wanna show you a couple of other examples. This is week one, but week 11, you'll notice goes to two digit by two digit as opposed to three digit or two digit by one digit. Here we have three digit by two digit starting at week 21 and at week 31, we have three digit by three digit. So you can see that depending on the level of your students, there will be something for them with the idea that you'll progress from most simple to most difficult. Now with this, I like to play a lot of games with this, find a way to make it fun so that it's not repetitive multiplication over and over and over again, especially in later weeks where those three digit by three digit or even three by two digit become very lengthy and time consuming. We also talk about naming fractions. This was one thing that I saw on standardized tests that a lot of my students with disabilities could not do, and there was really no reason for it. You could definitely figure out that this is three fourths or that this is two fifths. You could name it if you've been explicitly taught that. And so I wanna give students more than enough practice to name fractions. Then number patterns. A lot of students really find um, it difficult to use a hundreds chart or a multiplication chart to find patterns. And so again, just with daily practice, this is something that is very, very doable for many of our students with disabilities. Also, if you're working on this, area and perimeter can be very, very easily incorporated into that. So these numbers here will often match the numbers that you're using. So if these are two digit by one digit, these are two digit by one digit. If it's two by two, then these will often be two digit by two digit. So you can see every single day is the same, which is what our students with disabilities need. And it gives them the opportunity to practice in a safe, comfortable environment. And I can usually accomplish these books in about 15 to 20 minutes in its entirety. Sometimes we don't have that much time, so we might only get through a handful of problems here and fractions. And then the next day we just pick up wherever we left off. If you have any questions, please let me know.